Four years ago, efforts to restore an abandoned Nortin temple were sparked by a vision by the mystic Mohanji. As a result of the Group Areas Act, the temple's founder and his family were forced to move to Shalcross, and since then the temple lay largely undisturbed. Grandson of the temple's founder, Les Govender, spoke to the Rising Sun about his progress and plans for the historic site. From 2019, we started negotiating with various government departments, and uh, when COVID struck, we had to stop all of those negotiations. Finally, now we have arrived at a point where we know that this property now is on the books of the Department of Human Settlements, and we are now in negotiations with the MEC as well as the department to hand this property back so that it can become a community centre once again, like it was back in the day. Salosh Pillay of the Mohanji Foundation explained the NPO's part in the restoration. The Mohanji Foundation decided that we would look, and when we found this temple here, we said we would restore it to its former glory. We will help to give it back its dignity so that the community can take custodian back to this particular temple. But as we said, it's beyond being just a temple. It's a space, a sacred space, where anyone, regardless of what you believe or what your belief system is, you can come, just sit, imbibe the aura of this place here, and then enjoy a little meditation if you feel like it. Dr. Devon Chetty has been at the forefront of bringing the temple back to the community. And when I spoke to a few people, the doyans of the community, they were so excited and so enthused about getting this temple back to its former glory. And I think uh, their experiences, their love that they shared uh, with the kind of spirituality that they found at this temple uh, must not be discounted. And I think we must take that and fuel our passion to be able to restore this temple back to its former glory. This news video is brought to you by the Rising Sun Chatswood Digital Team.